view my YouTube video. This is Michael's Ghetto Beer Wine Judge Show. And today, we are going to be judging a beer known as Hurricane High Gravity Lager. This disgusting shit was picked up at my local gas station for $1.29. But, as effed up as you can get off of this stuff, it's probably a great value for a homeless man. Uh, first, I want to say today's episode is brought to you by the movie Predator 2. Um, great, great movie. Um, they've ruined the Predators now, of course, like they do every movie. This is back, though, the first actual guy, Danny Glover, the first guy who actually ever kill the predator on his own. I mean, Arnold, you know, he made the predator commit suicide. Did he really kill him? Yeah, he made him give up, blah, blah, blah. But no, this guy actually killed a predator with his bare hands. Danny Glover. That's why he was nominated president in the movie 2012. Anyways, back to the beer review. Uh, I need to look up a little information on this here. I'm so sorry for not being prepared. I need to, to tell you where this crap was made. It's obviously complete crap. So, no, don't let me be um, too negative on this. It could be the, the greatest beer ever. nothing on this so it doesn't matter we'll just go ahead and judge this I don't know what year this came out or anything it is a Anheuser Busch product it's part of the world monopoly of beer <clears throat> oh, King Cobra is also one of them I gotta find a good I don't know if they make it in the uh, in the tall cans let me know if they make a King Cobra in tall Someone let me know. Send me a comment. Um, well, no information really on Hurricane besides it's disgusting. And some malt liquor. Okay, well, first thing color. And you can take a look right there. That is relatively dark for a malt liquor. If your urine is this color, haven't just had a kidney stone recently and you do not drink nothing but turpentine all day long then you probably want to see a doctor <clears throat> uh, next we have smell very important if it stinks you can't if it stinks you can't drink you know what I mean oh yeah that's a that good disgusting that's that good old steel reserve smell. It has very similar, similar smell to that. Um, well, first off, color. Uh, let me go back to that. I'm sorry for rambling around here. Color is definitely a four. Could be worse. Smell. I'm gonna go with about two on smell. It smells completely disgusting, and I'm dreading the next part of the review. Which is taste. Take a deep breath. It's going to be okay. Hmm. Not as bad as Steel Reserve. I'm going to go with four. That's being nice. Smoothness. See what happens. No. Negative on smoothness. I mean, I didn't throw up, so that's not a one, obviously, or a zero. But I'm going to say about three. 
correctness, um, no, subject to change. Correctness is always subject to change after I finish the can later on. Um, but for what I'm getting from this right now, correctness seems pretty high. This is going to be his highest, um, highest part of the review. Crackers is going to be right around 8. That's taking a good guess. And that should do it for today's beer. Hurricane. High gravity lager. Um, if you are in a hurricane, I do not recommend drinking this. Because you will likely get blown away. Because you will be very unbalanced. Thank you for watching my video. Um, Viewer comments are greatly appreciated. Even if you're telling me I suck and I'm retarded, anything is awesome. Please dislike the video uh, down here somewhere. Um, if you if you think it sucks, please. Um, any anything, any kind of attention from other humans is awesome. Thank you, and have a good night.